grown the garden in a while and it's doing so good. I'm so happy. Look at these sunflowers, how tall they are. Hi. Come down here. I can't believe how tall these sunflowers are. And the stalks on them. Look how thick the stalk is. And I thought it would have just one sunflower at the top, but it looks like there's going to be so many. And I just popped it through the cattle panel as it was growing. Or the hog panel. So it had something to hold itself up. And we have our nasturtium growing with some flowers on it now. This side, for some reason, gets attacked by slugs. But we have a corn. Wait, we're slug? They're only here in the morning. They keep eating the leaves and stuff. So wake me up in the morning, okay, Mom? Okay. And then we have sweet peas growing up the trellis over here. Look at this one, Jace. Oh, I want to eat that. Okay, eat that. Let's see. Tell me if it's good. So delicious. Here, look at the cat. Yeah. Down here, I tried to do some cucumber, but they're not. I think they're overcrowded. We have a comfrey plant and some beans on the back. We have basil. We have that kiwi vine, the male and the female plant. Oh, here's another. I'm going to eat this one. Mmm, so good. Guys, can I tell you something? Okay. Next we have some basil, carrots. Should we pull out a carrot? Yeah. You want to eat a carrot? Yeah, cool. Okay, hold on. Back there we have a zucchini plant. And right here it tastes... Strawberries, which are getting licorice. buried. And this tastes like black licorice. We have a fennel. Which I heard you can make pesto out of these greens, which they taste like black licorice. It's which, crazy. Which they don't taste like black licorice anymore. And we have some lettuce and some cilantro that's flowering, so it's not very tasty. All these are carrots. Okay, and we have carrots. Okay, put it in the house. Look at this little carrot. I got you a carrot. You're naughty. You ate some yogurt. Okay. Then we have cabbage. Look at this cabbage. I think we're going to harvest that one tonight and have... We like to eat cabbage like on taco salad. So we use cabbage instead of lettuce. Then we have a pepper plant. And celery. Look at this celery. Nice beautiful celery. Tastes really good when it's fresh. And these are our tomatoes. Cherry tomatoes that I started from seeds from Baker Creek. Tons of flowers on them, but no fruit yet. And I'm just letting them go wild. I'm not trimming them or anything. I don't see any fruit yet. None. Nothing. All the flowers, no fruits. Cut. And that's the garden, so far. So this is fern, and we have our July milk test results back. Fern is our highest producing goat. We have three goats in milk that we do on test, which is Pippi, Gertrude, and Fern. Fern is our they're all first fresheners, but Fern is our highest producing goat. She milked 2.6 pounds this month, and her butter fat was 5.5%. 5 
so pretty good for fern lots of milk and she had two bucklings this year so it's pretty good milk for her what we like about ferns line is she has uh, some Woodbridge Farm lines. She has Woodbridge Farm Wyrena, who scored an LA score of EEE 92, which is really good. This is our newest goat, Pippi, and she did 1.6 pounds of milk, and she is our highest butter fat producer at 7.37 pounds of butter fat. And she's also a first freshener. She had triplets. I don't know if they were does or bucklings. I can't remember, but she had triplets and she's a first freshener. And her dam is Wild and Wild Ewan, which has, she has a really high LA score also of 90. I can't remember what the letters are, but she scored a 90. Next we have Gertrude. As you know, she was sick, but this month she did 1.6 pounds of milk, 6.12% of butter fat for Gertrude. So even though her milk dropped a little bit that last month that she was sick, she could still get her star based on her high butter fat. So we'll just keep watching to see what she does. Gertie is also a first freshener and she had twin bucklings as well. Go look. Oh, she did it. Good job, Gertie. Good job, Gertie. And Gertie has her lipstick on again. Gertie has her sap. <laughs> this is sap by Maybelline. Made <laughs> <Hey>, sap. Yeah. <laughs> Gertie's wearing her new lipstick in the shade Tree Sap. She looks so mad when you did that. <laughs> Do it again. Gertie's wearing her new lipstick <laughs> in the shade Teresa. 